Today, we show you how to use a single Alexa command to control multiple devices, coming up on Split Second Tech. Welcome back to another Split Second Tech video. So we all know that the Alexa is actually a pretty robust AI with hundreds of skills to be able to control hundreds of devices. So today, we're gonna show you how to set up groups to be able to control multiple different devices using a single command. The first thing that you're gonna want to do is of course, find your Amazon Alexa app and click on Amazon Alexa. Once it has loaded the homepage, you're gonna go to the bottom right-hand corner and you're gonna click on the icon that says devices. Once the device page has loaded, as you can see, I've already got some groups set up in here already, but what you're actually gonna want to do is come up and click on the little plus sign in the top right hand corner of the app. This is going to bring up a new page where it's going to ask if you want to add a device and add a group. For today's demonstration, we're going to be adding a group. Before you proceed, you will want to make sure that all of your devices have been found by Alexa and also they're named accordingly just to make it easier to find uh, when we add them to the group. Again, we're going to go ahead and click on add group and it's going to take you to a place where it's going to want you to name the group. Now, when you name the group, this is going to be the name that you're going to use in the command. So you can name it whatever you want. You can choose one of the defaults that they have listed here, or you can set a custom name up in the top. For today's demonstration, we're gonna set up Mission Control. And it's gonna go ahead and control the two soft boxes and also the LEDs for the ambient light. So Mission Control. Once you've got the name in there that you have selected or chosen, go ahead and click on Next. From here, it's gonna ask which device you want to add in this particular configuration. So again, we're gonna go ahead and add the left soft box. We're gonna scroll a little bit further. We're going to add the right soft box. And then I've got, again, these USB lights right here. They are plugged into the office USB, which is all plugged into a Wi-Fi power strip that's underneath this desk. So again, we're gonna click on office USB. They are selected by a check mark indication to the right of them. So to select, you just check it, and to unselect, you click it again, and you can see that the check mark will toggle on and off as needed. So left soft box, right soft box, office USB, and from here, we're going to go ahead and click on save. Once you've clicked save on the group, you're gonna get a little banner at the top, and it's gonna take you back to the group list of course, if this is your first group, you're only gonna have the one group listed in there. So when you go ahead and ask her to turn the device on or off, you're going to use the group name unless you want to specifically turn on one light. Or you can use the little toggle switch icon right here. If you see where it says on, you can click on that, it'll turn them on. And then of course, you can go ahead and click it again to turn them right back off. Now, of course, the group can be edited. So if later on you choose to do a different uh, configuration scheme, what you can do is you can click on the actual group itself, click on edit, you can click edit name. Once you've got that completed in, you're gonna go ahead and hit next or just hit done on the keyboard. So you can hit next or click done on the keyboard right down here. You can also go into edit and change the different devices that are in here. Again, just clicking on it once will toggle it off. So as you can see, I've got the soft boxes right here in the in the view of the camera. I've got the left soft box and I've got the right soft box back behind me over there. And then I've strung up the LED strip just so you guys can see it that when we use the command, it's going to fire off the left and right soft box and the LED strip, but we'll put it somewhere to give it some nice ambient glow somewhere in this office. So again, I've got the dot right back there in the corner of the desk, which is the same one that we used in the previous video. So in this case, let's go ahead and test out the command. Alexa, turn on mission control. Okay. So as you can see, again, she fired off the two soft boxes and also the LED strip because we've got that plugged into the USB, which was included in the group name as well. So there you have it. As you can see, going into the Alexa app and using the group feature allows you to take all of these different types of devices and create some pretty awesome lighting styles and configurations. And that wraps up today's split second tech video, bringing us into our question of the day. What other types of crazy configurations have you set up? Leave your answers in the comment section below the video. If you like this video and found it useful, be sure to give it a thumbs up and check out some of the other videos that we have on this channel. We do a lot of stuff tech related from how to and tutorials. So I'll link a couple over there on the right hand side of the screen for you. Subscribe if you're not already and be sure to enable the bell notification so you guys don't miss out on any type of future content and we will see you on the next one. Alexa, turn off mission control.